fact, it was uh, 54 years ago when our grandparents bought, uh, brought down 50,000 plantings from the Barossa and planted them just across the road here. And uh, yeah, so they started their own vineyard uh, and aptly named it Winninga, which in the Gunnawarra means many sticks. I'll skip to the stories about how I watched Alex grow from a child into the strong, resilient, intelligent, beautiful woman you see here today, and who is also just so kind. Right up till now where she met the man she thought she would never find. Alex, I stand here today knowing that in you, I found my truest and closest friend, my favourite, my love. It was a little over two years ago when we met in that dimly lit pub. I remember being lost in those big blue eyes where you regaled me with stories of your adventures abroad, along with an introduction to the family law system. <laughs> Nick, I can't believe we are standing here on our wedding day, just two years and 22 days after the day we first met. When I first met you, for a while I thought you were too perfect for me to be true. I only became more suspicious when I directly asked you what your flaws were and all you could come up with was that you were too nice. Two years on, and I'm honestly still in disbelief. <laughs> disbelief that I've found that someone whose values align so truly with my own like a compass to Magnetic North. <laughs> Alex, I love you. I love your boundless pursuit for knowledge, your selfless nature towards others, and your obsession with the 1990s thrillers. <laughs> we are all here to celebrate love, happiness, family, and in my opinion, a little bit of magic. First of all, Thank you to everyone here for making it tonight. Um, I know Alex and I have been very excited about celebrating today with each and every one, every one of you. Um, thank you, Mum and Dad, for your help and support leading up to today. Um, and to Teresa and the broader Harriet clan, um, never has a woman welcome to the family he didn't had. So on to the bit where she met Nick, ever the cautious as she is. <laughs> Mum! Alex said, problem? <laughs> He's too good to be true. There's only green flags. Very soon it was obvious to Michelle, Gordon and me that not long till an Eckert, Alex would be. I love your kind eyes and your cute smile. I love that you love rocks. I love that you always stay sensible and grounded even when I'm catastrophizing, which is often. I love when you wear your bright orange cap that doesn't go with anything. <laughs> These two come here today knowing that life won't always be perfect and neither will the person standing next to them. But love is knowing that we are not perfect and accepting each other as we are. It's seeing each other's flaws and loving unconditionally. It's challenging ourselves to grow as individuals and trusting that no matter how much we change, we still fit perfectly together. That's love and it's why we are here today with Nick and Alex. Can you feel it? I think we said too much too soon. I do you. Now you got me reeling. Spinning circles round this room. Did you notice me? Cause I've been standing out here waiting, baby, for a long, long time. And I can't tell. Coronies is what I drink. <laughs> this is um, so strange, I feel like we're acting. <laughs> so really heavily. Okay. It's gonna make great footage. <laughs> <laughs> 
to the uh, the beautiful bridesmaids. I know each and one of you played a really important part in Alex's life. Just thank you for supporting her to becoming the woman she is today. To the groomsmen, you guys are great. Thank you for always being there for me. You guys have always had my back and uh, I appreciate it more than I probably let on, but um, I really do care about all of you and so thank you for that. Now, as I've alluded to, Nick is a bit of an ass man. I don't think many of our friends here tonight can claim that they've not received a cheeky squeeze or two on the dance floor. But we forgive you. You're a passionate man. You bring passion to everything you do. And if you bring half the passion you do to your relationship that you do when you describe various rock formations around South Australia, then Alex, holy shit, you're a lucky girl. <laughs> Big stacks, my pockets are lofty. Speak facts, everybody wanna copy. Let me see you move like that. Get up on your feet and groove like that. Cha cha, real smooth like that. Make everybody shook when you do it like that. Let me see you move like that.